How often do you wonder if the man you like is thinking about you? Perhaps you find your thoughts revolving around him while you're at work as you stare into space asking yourself, does he think about me? Or maybe you've spent many hours, probably too many hours, talking to your girlfriends, dissecting the last messages he sent you, looking for that one elusive clue that answers the mystery of his feelings for you. If he's on your mind for most part of your day, it's only natural to want to know if he reciprocates your feelings. So if you're newly dating a man and you're not sure how he feels about you, or if you have a man in your life that you're not yet dating and you want to know if he's into you and you're on his mind, then stay with me as I'm about to share eight signs that someone is thinking about you a lot. Hi, I'm Nadine Peart, a dating and lasting attraction coach for smart, savvy women and the founder of Healthy You, Healthy Love. Now, before we continue, please be sure to comment below and let me know if there's anything specific that you'd like help with and if there's a topic you'd like me to do a video on. I want to find out who you are and what your needs are so I can support you on your path to big, sexy, and united love. And if you're new and haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please click the subscribe button and the bell button to get notified of my next video. So let's get back to our topic. In the early stages of attraction and dating, some men like to play it cool and won't overtly show their affections to the woman they fancy, while some men are more vocal and obvious about it. Whichever category your man falls under, there will always be telltale signs that are dead giveaways that he is thinking about you and most likely in a romantic kind of way. The first sign is number one, he asks about you. Some people are super self-focused and not all that interested in the details of anyone else's life. And yet a man who's genuinely interested in you and has time for you will ask you about you, your day, and your life. He'll also follow up and ask for more details. When he does this, it means he wants to get to know you on a deeper level because he cares. Number two, he's active on your social media. If you're on Facebook and you're not yet connected, don't be surprised to receive a friend request. The same goes for Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. If he frequently reacts or comments on your posts, or if he tags you in funny memes, that's his subtle way of letting you know, this reminds me of you. Basically, he's trying to find a reason to connect with you. These kinds of social media activities are pretty clear signs that someone is thinking about you a lot. Though do keep in mind that some men are not active on social media or may not have any social media accounts at all. So this point only applies to men who are social media savvy. Number three, he hugs you whenever you see each other. One of the clear cut signs that someone is thinking about you is the fact that he hugs you when you catch up. This isn't one of those one arm bro hugs. This kind of hug brings with it a warm, fuzzy feeling. When we like someone, we want to touch them and we tend to do it organically. It's often a natural impulse, which means if he's not hugging you, he'll probably touch you on your arm or move his thigh closer to yours while you're seated because he seeks closeness with you. That brings us to our next point, number four. He wants to spend more time with you. Whether you're in a work project together or out on a date, you'll notice that he's trying to squeeze in every single minute that he can with you. In a group setting, perhaps you'll notice him hanging around even when everyone is starting to go home so he can talk to you. Maybe he asks you if you wanna to go to a coffee shop after dinner or after a meeting so you two can hang out more. Whatever it is, you'll know that he wants to be with you as long as possible. Number five he chooses quality over quantity. Some guys go on dates but end up being on their phones for much of the time. Unless there really is an emergency, you'll know it doesn't feel very nice. But this won't happen with your man. If he's with you, he's with you. Years ago, I dated a man and whenever we were on a date, he'd always leave his phone in the car. A man with children may not do this, though I remember it felt quite lovely that he did this. Also, as much as I believe that frequently going on dates with the man you like creates emotional bonding and intimacy, sometimes our lives are super busy and we only have small snippets of time available each week for a date. So focus on the quality of the date and not necessarily on how often you see him, especially in the early days. To help you with this, I've created a free powerful quiz that's going to help you to understand your unique insecurities and uncertainties with men so that you can show up on 
dates feeling confident and empowered. If you suspect that you have some love blocks standing in the way of you getting the man you want, then check out my quiz. It reveals if you're experiencing one of what I call the four romantic love syndromes. If you're serious about finding the love you want, then the link to my eye-opening free quiz is below in the description. Number six, he remembers the small things. Does he remember how you take your coffee? Does he email you links to studies or podcasts related to your interests or job? Does he randomly give you a bouquet of your favorite flowers because of how upset you were the other day or your favorite chocolate or cake? These are undeniable signs that he likes you. He remembers the small things about you, even if it's something you said a few weeks or months ago. Number seven, he goes out of his way. When a man is really into you, he'll go out of his way to add some happiness and joy into your life. Whether that's driving into traffic to get you your favorite comfort food or calling you late at night because you've had a bad day at work, you know he does it for one reason, to support you and to help add some levity into your life. Number eight, he values your thoughts. The last sign that you're constantly in his thoughts is that he asks you for your opinions, especially on things that impact his life. He probably won't make a huge decision without asking you first, not because he's incapable, but because he truly values and respects your thoughts. So there you have it, the signs a guy likes you and the signs that someone is thinking about you a lot. If you see him doing most of these things, then you'll know that there's a very good chance that he's really into you and you can then decide where you'd like to take the relationship. The thing is, if a man is doing all or most of these things and you're still feeling that he's not 100% committed to you, then a few things could be going on for him. He either needs more encouragement from you to feel confident opening up to you or he's conflicted about his feelings. He's not sure what he really wants. I know this can feel confusing and frustrating, so to make this easier for you and so you know exactly what to do, my program Never Lose Him is perfect for this. I reveal some powerful tools to help you rise above the confusion so that you can activate the heart of the right man for you or have the courage to walk away from the wrong man for you. I teach what I call the LIPS method and this is the ultimate magnetic attraction formula. It doesn't matter if you're shy, loud, tall, short, funny, more serious, 25 or 65 years of age. When you cultivate these traits, the best men for you will take notice of you and you will know how to get the love you want finally. The link to Never Lose Him is in the description below. Well, that's it for today's video. If you haven't yet, please subscribe, comment, and give this video the thumbs up, and feel free to share it with a friend who could use some help in this area. It's been a great honor to have you here with me. I encourage you to choose to show love a little more in some way every day, and see you again at my next video.